Hello friends, this is Rupesh and you are watching CPP Nuts video series on bit manipulation interview question series and this is like 13 question and this video is about toggling the ith bit of a given number. So let's say if your given number is uh, x is equal to 10 and ith bit of this 10, let's say you want to tag toggle uh, third bit. So toggle meaning if it is 1 then you will make it 0, if it is 0 then you will make it 1. So, so far we have seen like converting either 1 to 0 or 0 to 1 but now we will not know that either it is 1 or 0 because we have to toggle it. This is interesting. So, 1 0 1 0 is the binary of 10 okay and third bit is this guy. So, let's see how we will do that. So, basically if you have ith bit in the question then you just close your eyes and create one mask like this i minus 1. So this will create a mask which will actually look something like this. Because we want to do something with the third bit you have to create a mask which looks like this and this is the formula for that. You have already watched my previous videos so you should not get confused with this and if you have not watched please go ahead and watch my previous videos. You will get the link in the description field. If you don't get it please comment I'll give you. So our mask is ready. Let's write this number here 1010. So this is 10. This is something we don't care what it is. The point is now this we want to make 1. You can say that okay I'll do oring here and then this will become 1. No problem you can do that. Then the result is this. This is desired result. But what if I ask you instead of 3 now change the fourth bit. So fourth bit is this bit right so 1010 our mask will be calculated and this time we will have something like this now if you do oring here because you give the solution to do the oring so if you do or here it is still going to be like this so this is zero so there is no change but we wanted to toggle this bit right i mean this bit it did not get toggled so to solve that if you remember there is a XOR operation which is if your two bits you are XORing between two bits if they happen to be same then the result is 0. So if it is 1 and 1 then the result is 0 if it is 0 and 0 then the result is 0 otherwise if it is different 1 XOR with 0 then the result is 1 if 0 XOR with 1 result is 1. So we want actually this I mean this whole thing. So basically we want this XOR operation not OR operation. So now you see this first case if we do the XOR 0 1 result would be 1. So if you see this 0 0 0 1 0 1 0 1 1 1 0 1 see this is exactly what we wanted correct so the trick is XOR operation let me quickly implement that and we'll sum up this video so integer mask is equal to 1 left shifted by i minus 1 time okay our mask is ready now in integer rsl equal to mask XOR x let's compile this it got compiled and if I run this it is giving you 14 so actually this is 14 because triple one zero is 14 if you'll put one zero I mean one here it will become 15 right so this is actually working so thanks for watching guys bye bye take care I'll see you in the next videos till then take care